can you please tell us your first name and your age? Hi, my name is Erin and I'm 39. What does it mean to be you? It changes all the time. I've gone through a lot of personal, internal changes over the last year. Being me, I've actually come to just accept that I don't always know. I can love tattoos anytime I want, but then I can also have my strict personal beliefs about certain things. None of it matters, right? It, it, there's not a rule book being me or what it is to be you. It really comes down to, lately for me, whatever feels right. I don't feel guilty for who I am anymore. And it's being me is just accepting who I am as a person and letting it evolve and change and knowing that, that that's okay. What does it mean to be perfect? I used to strive every day for perfection. I had identified to myself what perfect meant, and it meant no fault in any area of my life whatsoever. Fault being a very high bar. I mean, perfect to the point where all the people around me also had to be perfect and meet my standards because the only way that I could be perfect was if everyone around me was also achieving all of those expectations. So perfect to me is unachievable. Attempting to reach perfect will result in constant feeling of inadequacy, that it's just okay to be who you are and express who you are as a person and that maybe that is perfect enough. What does it mean to be 39? 39 is just a number. I was 10 when my dad turned 35. That was almost 30 years ago. And 30 years ago, there was the black balloon, the over the hill. My 10 year old self associated 39, 40 with being ancient, that your life was essentially over. Now that I'm almost 40, there are a lot of days that I feel like I'm just beginning. I feel very alive. I don't feel like I'm on the back side of anything. I feel like, wow, I have many years ahead of me to go be awesome, give myself to others, to share what I have in my life with other people. What does it mean to be kind? I grew up in the Midwest. Uh, we often hear about Midwest nice. When I moved to Colorado, I was confronted with truly kind people. Nice is something that we're conditioned to be or we're taught to be or we're told to be. As long as we're nice, you know, that's enough. Kind, kindness to me is taking that to a whole other level. Kindness is, is something that comes from within. It's needing to give a positive vibe, a positive feeling of yourself to other people. You cannot even try to put a facade on it. You cannot even try to put this wall up in front of you where you're like, oh, I'm, I'm gonna be nice to this person. Yeah, you can be nice and walk away and not feel a single thing, but kindness is feeling it. Kindness is taking it all in and, and, and feeling it in your gut. It's, it's, it's that knowing, it's that feeling piece of, of it. What does it mean to be a friend? Friendship to me is sharing your life and experiences with another person. It's not your husband, it's not your kids, it's not maybe even your sister. Family can be friends, but a friend is someone that you have chosen to be in your life, decided that you're going to be open and share your life with but it's also reciprocal. It's someone who you expect is going to expect the same thing of you. Friendship is an opportunity to let down your guard, be vulnerable with somebody else. But another aspect about friendship, I think that this is true with family too, but it's more than just accepting who they are as a person. It is also helping them navigate life. If you have a friend who is experiencing something that's self-harming to them, that you are exhibiting love for them by not enabling them. It's not necessarily judgment if it's truly a concern or care about how someone is doing in their lives. That agreement between two people that, that you're in that sort of relationship together. What does it mean to be successful? Defining success, it's become a hard thing for me to do, primarily because I've been training myself to not care what it means. I found myself so wrapped up and what a definition of success for myself that it was actually doing the opposite. I was pushing people away. I was pushing people out of my life. I was so focused on being successful that I forgot about the relationships that I had with other people that actually help achieve that. Perhaps truly being successful in life is achieving 
a balance being able to have solid and true relationships with other people identifying and achieving personal goals that you have without sacrificing people what does it mean to be confident confidence is something that i lack to me confidence equates to being sure of myself. What does it mean to be present? Being present to me means being accessible in whatever situation that you're in. You're emotionally and you're mentally open. It's allowing yourself to be accessible to others. What does it mean to be human? Being human is what we should all be striving for. When I think of the word human, I see peace, light, love, joy, and I see sorrow. I see it all the possible emotions. I see all the possible colors. I wish you could see inside my brain right now because it is glowing. I can't even describe it. What does it mean to be in love? In love, I, I feel like is a fleeting thing. It's flowers and it's Twitter patient and it's, uh, it's fleeting. What does it mean to be an adult? <laughs> There's no such thing. I have three kids. If there's anything that I've learned from them, being an adult sucks. But at the same time, it can be amazing. Now, to me, being an adult, yes, responsibilities. But I can still play and laugh and enjoy. But it's getting to truly experience yourself. What does it mean to be lucky? I don't believe in luck. I think things can coincidentally happen to people. But I don't think any one person is more lucky than somebody else. What does it mean to be a family? To me, a family is encompassing of any number of a group of people and that we just have different types of families. We can consider the whole human population a family. I have a work family, the simplest way to say it, people that I share my life with. What does it mean to be popular? <laughs> I wasn't popular as a kid. Popular means being put on a pedestal in someone else's eyes. People want to be you, but I wasn't, and I'm so glad that, that I don't care about that anymore. <laughs> what does it mean to be proud? I know what it feels like to feel proud. <laughs> I think proud can be positive, and I think it can be negative. Like when we are being too proud, we have thought way too highly of ourselves or having pride in other people, and I think that that's a much more positive thing, but I have a hard time putting more words to, to it. What does it mean to be free? For the first time in like my whole life, in the last year, I have actually felt it. Freedom to me is, is letting go of the care of what others think of you, what others expect of you. And that doesn't mean that you're letting yourself go, right? It just means that it's letting you focus on what you believe is true, is right, is positive in the world and what you can contribute. And so when I think of the word freedom from a personal perspective, it's just an abundance of yourself. Freedom is mentally breaking free, a mental freedom from, from expectation that you've probably even mostly put on yourself of what you think others, others expect of you. What does it mean to be a role model? Most role models, good role models, don't know that they're role models. To me, a role model is going about your daily life, practicing love, practicing kindness, practicing goodness, doing it in such a way that, that it's not necessarily hidden from other people. It's another way of opening yourself as well to other people. What does it mean to be safe? Being able to live without fear. What does it mean to be happy? We can have a constant joy and contentment in our lives. Happiness is more of, to me, like being in love, where it's more of a moment or a point in time where we are just experiencing extreme joy and it comes on in a rush and it can leave in a rush. To me, happiness is, is a small moment or a pocket in time of feeling that intense joy. What does it mean to be a survivor? To me, a survivor is being able to get up every single day and putting one foot in front of the other and persevering. What does it mean to be home? I love moving. I love experiencing new places, experiencing new homes. I would own like 10 of them if I could. To me, home is, is really just 
feeling comfortable and engaged with the people and the place in which you live. I think that you can live in the same place for your whole life and, and never experience that. And that's really sad. I, I feel for people that, that don't. I, I love that I have met people and learned things and found a way to make every place we've ever lived home.